He said that since the Quran was all sent down during the night of Al Qadr, and then it was sent down to Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam over a period of 23 years old, uh, 23 years, then it appears that everything was pre planned. Then why didn't Allah Azza wa Jal take, according to your words, precautionary measures to prevent certain things from happening like the Sahaba being killed? This is exactly what you said, correct? Okay. Well, let me broaden the statement that you said. Well, it's not only this 23 years that was uh, pre-planned. Everything was recorded before the creation of the heavens and the earth. Allah Azza wa Jal said that in the Quran. Min qabli an nabra'aha, before anything was created, everything was recorded. The, the book of Al-Bukhari, the, the first chapter is Al-Wahi, Revelations. And in it, there is a hadith, the first thing that Allah Azza wa created was the pen. Now don't think of a ink pen, pencil, no, no, it's Al-Qalam. We don't know the, the essence of it, but it's, it's something that is used to write with, right? And then Allah commanded it to write everything that will happen until the day of judgment. Now that is the knowledge of Allah. And according to the aqeedah of Ahlul Sunnah wal Jama'ah, nothing can be based by us humans, nothing can be based regarding our actions or reactions on the knowledge of Allah, because no one knows what the knowledge of Allah is. This is a very important point. Number two, Allah Azza wa Jal, though everything is recorded with Him in that preserved template, and known by him before it was ever created and came to being, right? Allah Azza wa Jal gave us the free will. And this is a very critical point to understand, by the way. Because a lot of people confuse the knowledge of Allah with our uh, ability to choose. Are we forced to do something or do we do it willingly? When, where do you live? Okay. When you took your car and came here, did you notice the angel under the car who lifted your car and brought you here? Did you notice him? No, there is none. I'm making a point. You made the choice to get dressed, put yourself in the car, and come to the masjid to pray and attend the lesson. Willingly. A person who picked up a gun and shot a person. Did the devil come and put a gun in his hand and put his finger on the trigger and forced it to shoot? Or he willingly picked up that gun and shot it? You get my point? So Allah Azza wa Jal gave us and clarified very, very clearly without any ambiguity the path to hell to hell and the path to jannah we showed him both paths good and evil jannah and jahannam right and he gave us the tools eyes to see ears to hear and a heart or aql to perceive, right? And gave us the will to make the decision after that. Whoever is guided, he only benefits himself with his guidance. And whoever is misguided, he only harms himself by choosing to be misguided. Allah will allow him to be misguided. Why did many of the companions get killed? Well, Allah Azza wa Jal uh, prepared Jannah for the obedient and Jahannam for the disobedient or the disbelievers, right? As for the disobedient of the believers, they will be cleansed there until they're purified from their sins and then they will go to Jannah ultimately. 
No believer with La ilaha illallah will eternally dwell in, in hell. Billah. So Allah Azza wa Jal is going to admit certain people to Jannah and certain people to hell. Those who are deserving of Jannah, Allah will facilitate the path for them to enter Jannah. One of the means is to be martyred for his sake. As, as a matter of fact, this is the highest level of, of, of uh, people in Jannah. Shuhada. So Allah Azza wa Jal knew that these companions were deserving of this reward. So he facilitated their path to Jannah by means of becoming martyred. Another uh, wisdom behind certain things happening, though Allah knew them. Well, how would we know that if you don't have water and the time of salah comes and you need to perform either wudu or ghusl then you use tayammum something happened had to happen to teach us you understand so on and so forth i hope this clarifies